Hey, it's me, it's me, it's Brad T here with BradThomasHardSupply.com and today I just want to go over a video on how to apply the Amazing Black to your canvas. Amazing Black is a lot like Amazing White, uh, except for it's black. Uh, this is very pigmented and so it takes very little to do. Uh, unlike other black mediums on the market, this actually will make your canvas very dark uh, instead of very lightly tinted. So, we'll get into this and I'll show you how to use it. Uh, so first of all, in here includes a mixing ball. So unlike any other um, pigment mediums out on the market, mine actually includes a uh, mixing ball in it. And on the back of it has inst instructions on how to use it. First you want to do is you want to shake up your jar. Okay? And these are bigger jars than the 8 ounce jar is. It's a little wider, it's a little thicker. And so when you get them, it looks a little bit like half full, but it's got 8 ounces in there. Uh, it's, it's more than half full. So we, we, we get like... I believe it's 11 ounce jar. It's a custom jar we get from a local uh, manufacturer. Okay, so we shake it up really good. You hear a little ball going around. Okay, then we'll open it up. This is a brand new jar. And then on the jars, this little gasket will come off. Okay, so just ring that across like that. Okay. And all that is from is from when it has been sitting and stuff. So when we get them, whatever out in there, everything sits, everything separates. So as soon as it's done mixing, it starts separating, and so it'll pull down this gasket, which creates a seal, and that way it doesn't uh, get messed up whenever you're uh, shipping it. So what I'll do here now is I'm gonna mix it again because it's a brand new jar. So when you mix it up like that, and you get, remove the gasket, then shake it again. You can really hear that ball going now. Because what it was doing is the gasket, the little foam gasket that goes in it, will uh, block it from mixing properly. So you have to remove that out of there when you get your jar. I'm not going to do two hands, get in there and mix it up. Okay, so now we're ready to apply it. And I'll show you how nice and what this looks like. So we'll move the camera in here and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, very nice and creamy, very nice and rich and black, okay? Just like the Amazing White, it's just black, okay? Okay, now to apply the Amazing Black, I use my two inch landscape brush. Uh, if you're using a smaller canvas, I would recommend the one inch landscape brush. But I'll just come here and I'll dip into the jar just a little bit, and then I'll just put a few dabs on my canvas, just a few dabs. Okay, after you put little dabs in here, I like to do X strokes. Now, whenever you're applying any medium, especially a pigment medium like Amazing Black or Amazing White, really make sure it's spread out to where you don't have any clumps in here, really thick deposits of paint because it'll start splattering everywhere. So really slowly spread it out. Then once you have it all nice and flat, or it's not lumpy where it'll spray, then you come in here with a lot of pressure and you really push it in there to the canvas and work it in there. X strokes and circles and, and all that good stuff. And do it all over the canvas. Okay, and I'm almost finished applying this to the canvas. I have not added any extra to the canvas from what I added at the beginning, which was I was just barely dipped into the jar. This has got a lot of pigment in it, a lot of uh, blending abilities into it, and it really covers the canvas really dark. This is just not the camera trick right here. This is really black. I'll move the camera up really close. You cannot see any white coming through. So, I'm gonna move the camera up here so you can see the white coming through here. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cover that in there. And you see how all of that white just disappeared. No other black pigment based medium on the market, I guarantee will do that. That's what frustrated me so much with others on the market was it never did cover it all that good and so you can see this really spreads this will really last you for a good long time okay and what the canvas is the canvas is nice wet wet and slick just like amazing white all right so as you see that's so easy to apply the amazing white to the canvas uh, you can actually see the canvas is covered really nice and dark so you don't have to do the finger test on like the amazing white you do but I still recommend doing the finger test so you know you don't have too much on. So just touch your, your finger on there and you'll see all those nice little finger grooves 
And I'll move my finger up to the camera so you can see it. Okay, that's all there is to it. All you gotta do is just touch it all on the canvas. And after I do that, I just kind of take my brush and just cover up on the, uh, the strokes of wherever I touched it at. So I recommend going around the corners, going into the middle, and just shaking it. Make sure you do. But just a very little bit, maybe a teaspoon amount of amazing black or amazing white on the canvas should cover a 16 by 20. Maybe a tablespoon or so uh, will cover it. So very little. So use a little at, at a time. Don't use a lot. Uh, just a little bit at a time will get you there. Alrighty. Hope this, you enjoyed watching this little video. This is a fantastic medium. I love amazing black. You can cover the whole canvas or you can cover so much of the canvas and the rest with amazing white or you can use the clear mediums. This is a fantastic medium. I think you'll really love it. Check it out at BrandThomasArtSupply.com and I'll see you guys real soon.